Warning, Cuphead is rated E10+. However, it includes themes of alcohol, gambling, and smoking. It also features the devil as the main villain. If any of this makes you uncomfortable, feel free to click off this video and watch something else. For a full rating review of this game, please visit www.esrb.org slash ratings slash 35333 slash Cuphead. Thank you and enjoy some good old timey fun. Hello, it's Classic Cookie Gaming and welcome back to Cuphead, where today we are going to jump back into Inkwell Isle number three. 88% through the game. All we have left, I believe, are this this train, Phantom Express, and then um, Mr. Dice and the Devil. So, one second, let me turn my volume down a little bit. Okay, and uh, but first, before we take on the train, we're gonna head back through the worlds and get the rest of the hidden coins that we don't have so we can buy the very last item in Pork Grind's shop. So let's go first up, Inkwell Isle number one. And the first one that we haven't gotten yet, right here we have to talk to Axe Boy. Say, fellas, thanks for settling things down around here. Maybe now I can collect enough dough to pay for my chipped blade. Speaking of which, I should get back to work. Gotta make hay while the sun shines. Hmm. Wait a minute. Did we already get this one? Well, once you know what, I already actually got that one. <laughs> well, okay. Um, the next one actually will be here. Wait, did I already get this one? Maybe I have. Ah, there it is. Had to go around it. It ends up being like right here-ish. Just kind of had to click A. Anyways, onward to... Uh, Inkwell Isle number three, back where we started. We're actually gonna wanna head right over here. And yep, there it is. You received a gold coin right behind this little shack here. And so those three that I showed were really the only, they were like the hidden, um, oh wait, I skipped one. Hold on, back to Inkwell Isle number two. Oh wait. Okay, 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 so for this one you have to talk to the juggler, and we've talked to him before, and you have to parry four times in a row, and he tells us that before, but I forgot that he was here, that we needed to go to him, so here's a coin to reward your persistence, boys, don't spend it all in one place now, and there we go, so yeah, that should be all the ones, the only other, I think we visited all of the, well, <laughs> except there is one more, that we have to wait until the next video to get um, because it is actually in the finale or right before the finale so we'll get that one uh, in the next episode I think maybe it might be two episodes from now whichever one is the episode of the finale or where we get to the finale one of those two but other than that we visited all the places today that have hidden coins in them there are a total of Let's see. Five, I think? That would make sense. Because that's how many we need to get the last thing. We need one more coin. Um, but we visited all the places today, except that one that we got a few uh, episodes ago, where uh, we had to find the shortcut for the lady. And then I... Oh, and then the tutorial. The tutorial was the only other one. So now, here we go. Our last thing before getting to Mr. Dice... The Devil's right-hand man, we have Phantom Express and Railroad Wrath. So... How do I have 8 HP? Uh, I don't understand why I have 8 HP. I don't remember... What did I do? That's insane. Um, okay, I'm gonna go on with this strategy. Am I gonna, like... Oh! Oh wait, hold on. We gotta, we gotta get him. Okay, I get it now. I, I don't get why we have eight HP. That seems a bit excessive. I mean, I guess I'm not complaining, but still. Oh, I need to go back here. Okay. I don't know that the lobber is going to be the best one. I think it still might be the chaser. 
Okay. Well, we made it right to the end of the first stage. I can see into the future. You will be counting worms. I don't know why I remember this as a skeleton train. It's quite obviously a ghost. Who knows? Well, anyways, we can take out those eyes pretty easily. Got that. If anything hits that this parry thing, or this one for that matter, it's going to cause it to make, go in whatever direction that side is. We need to avoid that a little bit. Okay, we can do this. Now we actually do need to go here so we can use this. Boom. Head back over here. This should get us pretty close to the second stage. I think. I feel like we don't really need that. Um, I, I think the one I got four parries in was that one ghost one. I mean, I don't remember there being, like, any other thing where that would have happened. I'm not that good. <laughs> Okay, well, anyways, I have some nice pumpkins. Should have played this one for how, <laughs> this level for Halloween. Oh my goodness. Oh, I may have prematurely used this. Whoops. Oh well. Oh, that's why. There's the bones. There's Mr. Boney. Oh boy. Still, I'm not sure how I have 7 HP. Okay. Okay, easy enough. Oh, wow, I didn't realize how close I was to avoiding that. Or, I guess, getting hit by that. Oh, boy. Stay in the middle. It'll be fine. I need to get more parries so I can just to whack this guy. That didn't work well. Oh, there we go. Ask and you shall receive. Ooh. Oh, well, we're on to the next stage already. That's how you do it. I still don't know how I have so much HP. I definitely didn't buy that one thing. I don't think I have a charm on. Oh my, how do you avoid that? <laughs> what on earth? Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we can do this at least. I'm not really sure how you... Oh, wait. You just have to do this. Duh. <laughs> well, we got the one ghost down. Oh, and there's the other one. I don't know if he's a ghost so much as a monster. Oh, my. Oh, now we're fighting the train. I think. Yep. <laughs> Classic animation here. Oh! Oh, wow. I almost got destroyed by that thing. Okay, we can do that. Grab some parries wherever we can get them, I guess. Oh boy. Because the train parry does not... A trip downtown! We completed Inkwell Isle 3! That was second try. Um, how did I get so much HP? I'm not gonna have a good HP bonus. Oh, two out of three. That's not bad, actually. Hey, we got a... What did we get? A B plus. Did I accidentally have, like, simple on? What? I guess not if we beat it. That is so weird. Why do I have so much HP? Yeah, it was on regular. Um, this had one HP. Um... That was weird. I don't understand what happened. What did I, what did I do? <laughs> uh, well, anyways, I mean, I would have died at least a couple more. Well, at least one more time. Who knows about the last time? If I only had four HP though, because I ended with three when I started with eight, so like, I would have died for sure. Well, anyways, um, casino entrance. Now here's the thing. I want Mr. Dice and the Devil to be their own separate videos, so we're going to end things right here. If you enjoyed this episode of Cuphead, then please do leave a like down below and also subscribe for some more Cuphead on the channel and click that notification bell so you can see when those videos come out. And uh, 
please leave a comment down below. How did I have so much health? I still am baffled by that. <laughs> but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this one. And until next time, go find a good book to read and have an amazing day. Bye.